Opening, there is growing concern about identifying people who may have COVID-19 symptoms. The idea is to get them tested, keep them isolated while they're sick so they do not spread the disease. One company here in Rochester is using a new device that it says will do just that. Atia Collins reports. Hawkeye Protection, a local security company, is thinking about how their technology can be used to keep businesses and customers safe as we look to reopen post-coronavirus. As we started to come back, companies are putting people by the door and they're physically scanning temperatures for everybody. Everyone who walks in is getting a manual temperature check in. Um, that doesn't really fit in with the social distancing that we've been learning. They have developed these thermal imaging cameras that can detect a common COVID-19 symptom, fever. This is what that camera looks like. And as soon as you walk into frame, it will start a scan collecting some basic health information. And as you can see, mine just popped up on the screen. Now this camera is also set to alert you if you're not wearing a mask, sending out this notice, reminding people to cover up when you're in public. And if someone walks by with a high temperature, Temperature is abnormal. Please check. It doesn't need any personal information. It's not doing any more than the regular standard camera. It's just taking your temperature, and that's just ensuring to the business owner and to everyone who's already in the business. Thermal imaging is not a new technology. According to CBS, companies like Flexible Symptoms, Thermal Guardian, and CrowdRx have manufactured similar cameras for use in airports and healthcare centers. The technology won't detect the coronavirus, but can be used as a tool as we look to prevent any potential spread. So if you have an event like a wedding, if you have an event like a, you have a work uh, situation where you want to have a lot of people together, those people can all be screened so you know have, with a relative sense of security that people inside don't have a fever walking in. And if they do have a fever, they're going to be sent for secondary screening. Reporting for News 8, I'm Atia Collins. All right, thank you, Atia. Governor Cuomo today reminding people that if you cannot stay six feet apart, wear a face mask. The, otherwise, he says, you run the risk of infecting others, which could overwhelm the healthcare system.